If you are traveling to an airport in a Spanish-speaking country, take really good notes during this video. We are going over everything that you need as a beginner Spanish learner when you are traveling. The first word that we have here is aeropuerto. Aeropuerto means airport, and this word for me is still extremely challenging to say. Aeropuerto. Next up, we have the word aerolínea, another difficult word to say. Aerolínea means airline. Aerolínea. Avión. Avión means airplane. Avión. And as you can see here, we have the accent mark over the O, so we're going to make sure that we stress that a little bit more. And we have the V here, so we're going to make sure that we pronounce this with the B sound, so the B in Spanish and not the B in English. So it's going to be avión, avión and not avión. Next up, we have the word vuelo. Vuelo means flight. Vuelo. And make sure that we pronounce this V or B sound properly. Vuelo and not vuelo. Equipaje. Equipaje means luggage. Equipaje. And make sure we don't say equipaje. So it's not going to be equipaje, but equipaje. So that one's a little bit challenging as well to pronounce. Equipaje de mano. Equipaje de mano means carry-on bag. Equipaje de mano. Maleta. Maleta means suitcase. Maleta. Mochila. Mochila means backpack. Mochila. And don't make the same mistake that I have made in the past and add a, another L here. So I would say mochilla instead of mochila. So don't do that. <laughs> Tarjeta de crédito. Tarjeta de crédito means credit card. And here we're not going to say tarjeta, pero but tarjeta and we have the accent here over the e so we're going to make sure that we stress the e here so credito and not credito licencia licencia means license this is another word that has been incredibly challenging for me to say licencia pasaporte pasaporte means passport pasaporte boleto Boleto means ticket. Boleto. Tarjeta de embarque. Tarjeta de embarque means boarding pass. And here again, we're not going to say tarjeta, but we're going to say tarjeta. Identificación. Identificación means identification. So as you can see here, these words look fairly similar, but you're definitely going to pronounce them quite differently. Identificación. Pasajero. Pasajero means passenger. Pasajero. And not pasajero. Tripulación. Tripulación means flight crew. Tripulación. Puerta. Puerta means gate. Puerta. Terminal. Terminal means terminal. So again, here we have the Spanish word and the English word looking very similar, but they are pronounced quite different. Terminal. Puerta de embarque. Puerta de embarque means boarding gate. Puerta de embarque. Recogida de equipaje. Recogida de equipaje means baggage claim. Recogida de equipaje. Abordaje. Abordaje means boarding. Abordaje and not abordaje. Pero, but abordaje. Inmigración. Inmigración means immigration. And here, pay very close attention because we don't have two M's here like we do in English. But there is an N, N A, and there's also an M, M A. Inmigración and not immigración. Llegadas. Llegadas means arrivals. Llegadas. And as you can see here, we have the double L, so we're going to be pronouncing it as Y and not 
l, like legadas, but llegadas, salidas. Salidas means departures. Salidas. Retraso. Retraso means delay. Retraso. Cancelación. Cancelación means cancellation. And if you have noticed, this I-O-N ending of these Spanish words have this ion sound. Ion and not ion. So it's not cancelas ion. But it's cancelación, sion. And that makes a big difference in the pronunciation of these words. Escala. Escala means layover. Escala. Despegar. Despegar means take off. Despegar. Aterrizar. Aterrizar means to land. Aterrizar. Seguridad. Seguridad means security. Seguridad. I hope you feel more prepared for when you go to an airport in a Spanish-speaking country. And if you didn't know, you can now become a member of this channel. Click on the join link in the description box of this video to find out what perks you'll receive as a member. Now watch this next video to learn some beginner Spanish travel phrases.